Okay, so what we're going to learn today is about how to find the least common denominator of a particular fraction. For example, if you have a fraction 5 over 10, and you're gonna add it with uh, 7 over 12, for example. Okay, so this fraction have different uh, denominators 10 and 12 and in fraction you cannot add fractions which have the different denominators so what are we going to do here first thing to do is find find the LCD LCD means least common denominator Okay, so to find the least common denominator, it's just that we're going to find common number or one number that can be used as denominator for these two fractions. Okay, so to find the LCD, first thing to do is to find the prime factors, prime factors of the denominator. Okay. Uh, to find the prime factors of the denominator, so we just write 10 and think of prime numbers that can be used to multiply to that to get the value 10. So we write down 2 times 5. 5 is a prime number, 2 is a prime number, so 2 times 5 are the prime factors of 10 what about 12 we're gonna have 12 all right so we have 2 times 6 right but 6 can be broken down into 2 times 3 right okay so that will be a equal to 12. So these are the prime factors of 12. Now we're going to get this one. These are common. So we just copy that 2. Okay. We just have another 2, 5, 3. So that the LCD, LCD now, is equal to 2 times 2, 4 times 5, 20 times 3 is 60. 60. Therefore, the LCD of 10 and 12 is 60. Now, we can already use 60 as the uh, common denominator for the fractions 5, 10, plus 7, 12, so that we will be able to add them together. So Alright, so a while ago we've written 60 and 60. Now, how did we get 30 on top of the fraction that's uh, multiplying the numerator with the number that we used to multiply also 10 to get 60. So 10 times 6 is 60. So multiply this one also 5 times 6 also. That's times 6 is equal to 30. Alright, so it's just like when we multiply the numerator and the denominator with a common number, which is 6 over 6, which is equal to 1, we get a fraction 30 over 60. And to get 35 also, we multiply 12 by 5. So this one, multiply also by 5, right? 12 times 5, you get a 60 there. 70 minus 5, we have 35, okay? So we've got now the same denominators. Therefore, we can now add the fraction 30 plus 35 equals 65. And we just copy 60 here. We don't add the 60 anymore. So we have 65 over 60. All right. So this is an improper fraction. So we can change this one into simpler form by dividing 65 by 60. We get 1. There's remainder 5. And we just copy 60, the denominator 60, 1 over 5 over 60, or reducing further the, the fraction part, which is 5 over 60, copying the 
uh, whole number there, 1 divided by 5, that becomes 1. 60 divided by 5, 12. Therefore, the answer for this fraction, 5 over 10 plus 7 over 12, is equal to 65 over 60, or reduced to lowest term, 1 and 1, 12. Okay, so that's it for today. Thank you for watching.